Hey everybody, in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to upload Google Sheets files to a ChatGPT conversation and use the data of the Google Sheets files for analysis and all that good stuff. So first, let me show you, this is the test data set I want to add to ChatGPT. And there are some workarounds, of course, you can use. For example, you can download this file as a CSV or as an XLX file and upload it as a regular file to ChatGPT. But if you want to connect this Google Sheets file to ChatGPT, there is also a way to do it. First, what you have to make sure is that you are using the ChatGPT 4.0 model. Then you also have to make sure that if you click on your account name, select settings, then select connected apps and make sure that Google Drive is connected to your ChatGPT account. So click on connect here and connect your Google Drive account. If you don't know how to do this, I have another tutorial on my YouTube channel that you can check out. But once your Google Drive account is connected, you can just add Google Sheets files to your conversations. So all you have to do is select this attach icon, then select add from Google Drive here. Then you will see all your files in your Google Drive folder. Search for the file name you want to add to your ChatGPT conversation. So in this example, this test data set, and let's say, give me an analysis of the data in the file, then press enter. And then as you can see, ChatGPT was able to feed in the complete data table to the uh, conversation. And uh, now it's gonna be able to give us some summary statistics and any kind of business insights it can find from this data set. So notice I can upload a Google Sheets data file to your ChatGPT conversation. Hope you found this tutorial useful. If you want to get access to the custom GPT database and other free ChatGPT and AI resources, make sure to check out the links in the description below. And if you want to learn more about ChatGPT, custom GPTs, ChatGPT plugins and other AI software, make sure to check out our YouTube channel and playlists because we have over a thousand free tutorials and also make sure to subscribe because we have more tutorials coming up.